There's some pretty big news coming out of my home, Australia, today, with Reuters reporting that Qantas is nearing a deal for the Boeing 78710 that would enhance its wide body offering. That would enhance its wide body offering and obviously the 787 presence within its fleet. According to a Reuters source, an unspecified number of 78710s being ordered is very likely, following an ongoing fleet review by the Australian carrier. Qantas, if you didn't know, welcomed its final 787 around a month ago, and thus far the aircraft has definitely been a fantastic option for its wide-body operations. When this has been possible, given the pandemic-related restrictions did ground most of the fleet for many years. Additionally, it has also been a plane that is meant to can substantially grow its network, with route pairings such as Perth to London being made possible and proving an efficient replacement to other aging aircraft. The Boeing 787-10, as in its numerical sequence, is the largest member of the 787 series and comes packed with additional capacity, but still also fantastic capabilities for range and flying. Qantas, though, at the moment only operates the 787-9, the middle ground if you will. Thus, the Dash 10, if they went ahead with it, would be a new type in the fleet and definitely a step up for the carrier. There's been much talk around Qantas securing wide bodies, as covered pretty extensively here on the publication, with most under the firm belief that if Qantas wants to achieve future growth goals, and that includes expanding to new destinations, increasing frequencies, and a whole lot more, the current crop of aircraft will not be enough. This can only be highlighted when we do consider are the incoming arrivals for the airline in terms of wide bodies, and that includes the A350-1000. The A350-1000s have been ordered specifically for Project Sunrise operations. Will this ease the stress on the 7879s? Sure, but as many would say, considering there are replacements needed for the A330, an aircraft like the 78710 would be truly perfect in every single regard. Not just allowing the A350-1000 to thrive, but the 7879s to continue doing what they do best. With the return also of the A380 being considered, pressure has certainly eased on the 7879s for those international services. However, strengthening that portfolio of the Dreamliner and allowing more routes to be made possible would be incredibly helpful, you'd have to think. Qantas is at the moment studying a replacement for its A330, as I briefly touched on, and this is part of the continued commitment at the group to overhaul its fleet. It is why we've seen so many aircraft orders and also why in the next couple of years the Qantas fleet is going to change drastically. The A330 is one of the last aircraft types that does need replacing and such a Boeing 787-10, per Reuters, could certainly fill the boots of this aircraft while offering fleet commonality. The Australian flag carrier only has 14 7879s in service, which may seem like a lot, but for an airline with lots of ambitious plans in the future that it wants to make possible and to be in line with Australia's continued growth, there needs to be a view of growing the fleet. And the 78710, if talks continue progressing in a positive direction, could just very well be the perfect option for them. Are you in agreement? Or do you believe there's another aircraft out there that could fill the boots perfectly? Let me know down below in the comments and no doubt we'll be keeping a close eye on this order in the future. Take care and be safe and I'll see you next time. And we'll fly.